Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. So in this video I'm going to show you how you can make one of these uh, nice simple but effective um, guards for your bird box and it will guard the whole of the box and stop uh, things like squirrels and rats getting in and harming the chicks but it will also allow you to kind of um, change the purpose of your box let's say if the hole is large and you want to shrink it down to attract smaller birds it will work for that as well so recently my dad made me this cool looking bird box but um, the hole is too big for the type of bird that I want to attract so I'm looking to attract a blue tit which needs a 25mm diameter hole and I have another box also that I'm going to uh, make a plate for so I'm going to make one out of plywood and one out of aluminium so now I'm just marking up to make a square piece and then I'm using the ruler to find the center point the idea is to just have a material which is denser and harder than the material of the box most uh, boxes that you buy are quite soft wood so this is a nice dense plywood and this aluminium should do just fine so for the wooden one I'll just cut the, uh, the piece off the end and then for the aluminium one I used um, a metal cutter and then I rounded over the corners you don't have to do this but um, I just had the tool so I thought I'd just quickly round over those corners so now we have our two plates we just need to start making the hole so for the hole I'm using a 25 millimeter force in a bit and if you're looking to attract larger birds all you need to do is use a larger force in a bit for the aluminium piece I made sure it was nicely clamped down to make sure there was no movement and went very slowly to remove the aluminium So now I wanted to drill some pilot holes on each corner. And the same for the aluminium plate. And any small piece of metal should do the job just fine. So now I just gave the plywood plate a quick hand sand to remove any rough edges. And I quickly gave it a coat of linseed oil just to give it a bit of protection from the weather. And for the metal plate I just went round the inside of the hole with some sandpaper to make it smooth. Now it's time to add the plate. So for this box I'm going to use the metal plate and I'll show you in a moment the other box that I'm going to use the wooden plate for. So now you can clearly see that this box is well protected, nothing can kind of gnaw through this metal and that will keep the hole in the size that it needs to be and keep the chicks safe. 
So now I just needed to get the box into its new position. And that's the other box that I added the wooden plate to. So that's about it for this video guys, if you found the video useful please remember to like and also consider subscribing for more DIY related videos. I also have a few more videos about how to make bird boxes as well, so I'll leave links in the description box below for those if you're interested. So as always thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time.